Writing. Making something out of nothing. It's something that's always been close to me. It's always been what I'd do best at in school. I don't know what I'd do if I couldn't use my imagination. I love to build and transform things, like snow and sand to creations of art, and pencils and paper to stories of fantasy. I want to go on to college to continue doing this for a living. What happens when I write is something I can't explain. Sometimes when I write, it's just basic sixth grade stuff, like anyone could have written it. But when I get into my writing zone, I feel like I've entered a different state of mind, a different part of me. First, I just relax myself. Breathe in. Breathe out. No matter where I am, if I relax myself, then I can get into my writing zone. Then, I look through my mind and try to find a peaceful place. Whether it's the bottom of the ocean, or the highest place in the sky, or on the calmest beach. When I'm in this peaceful place, the ideas start flowing out of me like a river. And as they reach the falls, they pour onto the page, written down and saved in a special place inside of me. For example, when I wrote Galaxy Gal, I pictured being in the stars and a spaceship zooming by, and that's when the idea struck me. When I write, I'm physically at my desk, in my room, but I'm worlds apart from there in my mind. And when I get to this place, no matter where it is, I can make anything. Not just stories, but sculptures and shapes and buildings and people. When I'm in the zone, I'm never in the exact same relaxing place twice. If I couldn't rely on my imagination to take me into my writing zone, then I wouldn't have as much joy in my life. A life without pencil and paper is no life for me.